The family of Carla Stefaniak, who lived here in Tampa for about 10 years, tells us they have not heard from her since Tuesday evening. She was supposed to get on a plane and fly into Fort Lauderdale on Wednesday, but she never did. You can catch a glimpse of Carla Stefaniak's spirited personality in these videos filmed in Costa Rica. It says April's day, but it's like Carla's day too. April Burton, Carla's sister-in-law, gave them to us. They took the trip together. She says she can hardly watch them. It's just really hard because, you know, I do at the end of the day, I do feel I do feel, you know, guilty because I left earlier. So, you know, you start doing those what ifs. April flew home on Tuesday. Carla planned to leave Costa Rica on Wednesday. She stopped responding to April on Tuesday night. I told her I think my flight's delayed because I had a layover in Fort Lauderdale and she said that sucks. And then that's all I heard from her. And that was at 8.54 p.m. April knows Carla made it to her Airbnb in San Jose, but she does not know what happened to her next. We just know she's been abducted. There's no reason for her not to have had any contact with anyone. It's been five days. Carla's brother is currently in Costa Rica, retracing his sister's steps. He visited that Airbnb. Went there the night before and left at 5 a.m. Everything's Gone. She left with everything on hand. The family does not know who she could have been meeting. They are now taking to social media, pushing for the United States to get involved in the search. Carla's brother tells us he bought a one way ticket. He plans to stay in Costa Rica until he finds her. Reporting here in Tampa, Gabrielle Shirley, News Channel 8.